Hello and good afternoon, live from the Zero Project Conference 2022 from the Vienna International Center. My name is Anna Königseder. I'm the business sector manager of the Zero Project team, and I'm very happy to welcome my guests from the Vienna Business Agency, Silvia Göttinger from the Technology Services. Silvia, nice to have you here today. And Dudo Genzel from the Startup Services. Hello, Dudo, nice to talk to you. Uh, I suggest we start with a short introduction of yourself and also of uh, the activities of the Vienna Business Agency and um, the role you play in the business location in Vienna. Hi everyone, I'm very happy to be here um, at the Vienna International Center. It's the first time for me to be here, so I really enjoy uh, the time spent here. Um, so who are we? We, I personally work for the startup services of the Vienna Business Agency. Um, who are we at and what do we do at the Vienna Business Agency? Let me just give you a brief introduction about us. The Vienna Business Agency takes care of the business location Vienna and its companies and startups here in Vienna. We have different services we provide to existing companies, but also startups who are interested in starting the journey here in Vienna. We have consulting services, we have financial support we can pro uh, provide to promising projects, and we engage a lot in real estate and urban development projects. I am a responsible um, for or all our international activities within the startup services of the Vienna Business Agency, and I'm also the co-host of the Discover Vienna program. Hi everyone, my name is Silvia from the technology services uh, team in Vienna Business Agency. Uh, we have a small team uh, with sustainable technologies focus and I'm uh, personally focusing on assistive technologies and social innovation. We connect people, this is the, the most important aspect of our team. Thanks a lot. So the Zero Project and the Vienna Business Agency have joined forces and jointly organized the Discover Vienna Zero Barriers program. This means that 10 startups have been selected and they are uh, spending one week in Vienna. And perhaps, Dudu, you can tell us a little bit more on the motivation for the Vienna Business Agency to host programs for international uh, startups. Um. I mean, the, the main motivation behind Discover Vienna is definitely to bring more people with a global mindset to the ecosystem of Vienna, connect them with the local community here and create some synergies. Um, and as you can tell by the name Discover Vienna, Discover Vienna is really about discovering your opportunities here, create some meaningful connections with the community in Vienna and this all with the help of the Vienna Business Agency who has a very good overview about the whole ecosystem and can help you to find the right stakeholders to talk to you when you want to establish something further here in Vienna. We are also very happy about the, the cooperation with Zero Project and the ESL Foundation. Uh, they asked us uh, whether we could cooperate a little bit more and therefore we, uh, we uh, tried uh, the first steps and, and uh, organized this Discover Vienna program uh, Zero Barriers uh, due to uh, my uh, focus in the, in the work uh, with assistive technologies. It is a very important aspect and I own, uh, also want to show uh, this technology report uh, we published recently uh, about assistive technologies. So Dudu, perhaps you could uh, talk a little bit about uh, the next opportunities to join another program for the international audience, but of course also for the audience in, in the rooms here at the, at the Vienna International Center. Yes, I'm very happy to share those opportunities because I believe we do have some very good things in place coming up in the next months and weeks. So first of all, um, everyone out there who has a startup in the field of social entrepreneurship, please check out our website because we're now planning or we already have a call for social entrepreneurs out there. It's called Discover Vienna Changemakers and you can apply until 
April. So check out that first opportunity. And the second opportunity would be the Vienna Startup Package, where you would could come to Vienna for one month in May 2022. And last but not least, we're also planning something big uh, uh, at the end of May 2022. It's called Vienna Up. It's a decentralized festival tackling all kind of topics from the startup and innovation landscape. And there will be also a lot of opportunities for social entrepreneurs to get connected with the international community of impactful entrepreneurs. So please go on viennaup.com, sign up for the newsletter so that you get all the information straight into your inbox. Uh, some words about one activity within Vienna Up. It will be the Smart City Summit. Uh, and one of the sub-themes where will be the barrier-free city. So it's also, this is also especially interesting, uh, I guess, for you. And it will take place on the 30th and 31st of May uh, as part of the Vienna Up. And for everyone who is interested to meeting the participants of this year's uh, Vienna Discover Zero Barriers program, tomorrow there will be a fireside talk where all the 10 participants will give uh, feedback on, on the week they have spent in Vienna. And perhaps, Udo, you could, you could uh, give uh, some more details what the program looked like so far for, for the participants that are this week in Vienna. So it was a very intense week already. So we kicked off on Monday with a great uh, get to know each other breakfast and then continued with a short um, input on how to, to put the strategy towards market entry. And, and on Tuesday, they had a great opportunity to meet with some relevant stakeholders from the Viennese ecosystem and now we're here at the Zero Project Conference, enjoying some time with the international community here and with the Viennese stakeholders. And yeah, let's. I, I'm, I'm very curious to listen to their experience because you know I can tell a lot of good things, but let's see if the startups enjoyed as much as we did at the Vienna Business Agency by hosting them. Thanks a lot. I think uh, Petra will do some some a summary for us for this session. Or, yeah, yeah good. Then over to you, Petra. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, my first question was it Vienna up or Vienna app? Up. up. See, I got it. It's up. <laughs> so, Vienna up. I put a balloon here. So, uh, Okay, we heard about the Vienna Business Agency, um, an agency concentrating on uh, making sure that Viennese uh, business, um, businesses come here and stay here and grow. It's all about startups, social entrepreneurship. You're also connecting people, so it's a very connective job you're doing. And uh, one program was um, Discover Vienna. I tried to draw Vienna here with the Danube and the Donaukanal. <laughs> and um, you're also, again, focusing on startups. And the last thing, last but not least, is Vienna Up. It's a festival where, where especially social entrepreneurs, but others, can come together and celebrate, celebrate life, <laughs> celebrate the location of Vienna. And I will be very curious to hear what happened this week uh, with participants from the Zero Project Conference who came here. Um, I didn't finish drawing it, but I think we'll hear, hear more of that um, as we go along. So let's look forward to that. Thank you. <laughs> thanks a lot, Petra. So uh, Dudu and Silvia, thanks a lot for joining us today. We at the Zero Project are really very happy about this cooperation and we are very much looking forward to our next uh, joint programs. Thanks a lot and uh, hello again from the Zero Project Conference 2022 in the Vienna International Center. Goodbye. Thanks for listening. Ciao. Bye.